I made these ambient videos to accompany you, my friends, and now I'm gonna show you how you can also make one to accompany your special someone. Ambient videos are what people project onto screens to create a vibe, especially during holidays. The problem is, when I search for Chinese or Lunar New Year ambience or Year of the Dragon, I didn't find anything that I would like to use in my own home, especially the visuals. So I decided to make it myself. Several, actually, to fit different occasions. I am no professional graphic producer. So I used AI as an assistant. The AI tools are mostly quite intuitive, but if you need detailed tutorials, you can easily find a lot of nice ones online. In this video, I'll just focus on the overall workflow. To generate the images, I used Leonardo.ai. The whole process starts with writing a prompt to describe our own mental picture, including the elements, and the overall style. That's the creative part. If you don't speak English, you can use tools like ChatGPT to translate your idea, copy and paste in here, and then AI will generate the image for you. Which might sound easy, but if we check out the existing videos out there, we'd often see something bizarre, like tails growing from weird places, strange looks and distorted limbs, and so on, even if we use accurate prompts. Actually, I had to generate over a hundred such pictures to finally select three pictures that met my standard. Double tails, a three-fingered claw, which is culturally inappropriate, this one, looks a bit too fierce for a holiday setting. Trees grown in a dining room? Nope. So it actually took a lot of careful curation to finally get something like this, this, and this. Well, this one is interesting because the scenery looks nice, but personally, I like something even more culturally rich, perhaps by using some ink painting. So I generated this other image, and later you will see how I merged these two pictures to get something like this. Next, to animate some images, I used a combination of Pika, Runway, and Leonardo. This process also took a lot of curation. For example, I cannot tolerate fluid dragon teeth. All right, now that we have the pictures and animations, it's time for editing. There are two types of ambient videos in my channel. One has subtle movement, mostly in the background. For this type, our approach here is if we want, say, snow or fireworks happening only on the outside, then we'll need to separate out the background into a different layer so that whatever happens outdoor does not impact the indoor. So we start with photo editing. I'm using Photopea here, which is a free online software. Most importantly, we need to carefully crop out the background. I also removed the bad calligraphy that AI tried to fake. And finally, it's time to put together all the elements into different layers in an editing tool starting with the outdoor scenery, snow, the indoor stuff, flickering candle flames, and so on. And finally, add the music. Most of the music I use came from the YouTube audio library and CapCut. By the way, here's how I made the snowfall. First, download a green screen snow scene then cut out the green background using the eyedropper. And then minimize the saturation to remove any residual green color, which was a quick hack. The other type of ambient videos has more 
drastic animation to fit the dragon theme, for example. Here, since we've already gathered all the animations in the last step, our focus now becomes putting them together in the right sequence to tell a cohesive story. And equally important, creatively matching the music with the visuals to create a consistent vibe. Also, I had to add these starry elements that track the eyes because AI would often exclude pupils in dragon eyes, which can sometimes be associated with misfortune culturally. So the entire workflow requires creativity and careful curation to produce something that is enjoyable, consistent, and culturally fit. All right, my friends, leave your questions and thoughts in the comment section below. And hopefully some of you will use this method to create an ambient video to celebrate your favorite festival or accompany your special someone.